Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Democracy 3 with me, Alpha P Omega. Now today we are going to continue the series of small countries on 200% difficulty. Today with Slovenia. So Slovenia is a small country in Central Europe. It has a very high GDP and a low Gini and is doing remarkable compared to other nations in Southeastern Europe. It is a member of the EU and has been since 2004. It gained its independence from Yugoslavia in 1991, signaling the breakup of Yugoslavia. Now, these statistics uh, are slightly flawed. I'm going to tell you which one are incorrect. We have a population of 2,060,200 people, that's correct. But the size is not 7,827 square kilometers. This is actually in square miles. In square kilometers, it's 20,273 kilometers. Life expectancy is 77.83 years, that seems correct. GDP per capita, though, is not 29,000 euros, but it's 24,550 US dollars. Poverty 6%, religion, Catholic, Christianity, obesity rate 1%, annual inflation 1%, unemployment rate 18.1%, and graduation rate 87%. I haven't checked these, um, could be correct, though obesity I would guess is slightly higher. Inflation probably okay, but I think it has been um, going into deflation in the Eurozone lately. I haven't checked the latest statistics, and especially for Slovenia though. But the history of Slovenia is really good people, you should check it out, they got some interesting stuff going on in the past. Anyway. We're gonna play with hur hurricanes. Why do I always fuck up that word? Hurricanes, earthquakes, 20%, 200% difficulty, not 20%. Wow, 20? Can you? Yeah, you can. 200% difficulty. We're gonna have no term limit because there is no term limit for Prime Minister of Slovenia. And we're gonna play as the Justice Party as I rolled 67 on the dice. Um, there's not much more here. Let's have. Rather, uh, the Independence Party as our opposition party name and start. Let's see what Slovenia brings to us. <laughs> okay, awful, awful GDP. Health, education could be much better. Unemployment could be worse or better. Crime on increased poverty on a decrease. So yeah, we got quite a lot of interesting um, things going on. We got antisocial behavior, alcohol consumption, we got uh, dementia, obesity, and tooth decay. We got black market, uncompetitive economy, and oh my god, corporate exodus and emigration. Hmm. So how bad is it? It's really bad. It is really bad. Holy crap. Corporation tax. That one is just tanking it. Okay, we're getting 26.69 billion from that. Of course, of course, the deficit is awful. Holy hell, that is not bad at all. But we really need to do something with this. Uh, and Good thing would be to tackle uncompetitive economy and corporate exodus at once. Also the black market, yeah, that one costs a lot. Has no effect though, but has a huge cost. Hmm. Tooth decay. Not really all that bad. Obesity. Overs health and thus. Alcohol consumption is insane. Religious membership? How is religious? Oh, we have no religious people at all! Wow, we got 78,000 religious people in our country. That's interesting. Capitalists hate me, though. Oh, no wonder. Yeah, GDP, uncompetitive economy, corporate exodus, limit automate, limit automated training. Why did I... Limited trading device, circuit breakers, ban high-tech frequency, Total man. Where's the GDP for some reason? Uh, I'm gonna. What's this one doing? Horse conservatives increases crime, tourism, house crime. Oh god, crime is on the rise. 
has been going a lot. Okay, what I would do at this point would be lowering the corporation tax to a bare minimum. It's gonna help. It's gonna help everything apart from our expenses. What could we? And we're spending a lot on the military. Let's go with 18 billion. Okay, that pretty much uh, negated itself, though we're still gonna fall slightly more into the depth. Uh, but yeah, next time we're gonna take a couple of things to stimulate the economy and. We're losing the alcohol abuse. What's our alcohol? I'm kind of curious. The alcohol consumption is really high. Alcohol law, yeah. Oh, we got minimal age of 16. You know what? I'm gonna go with minimal age of 21. And we're gonna take the alcohol awareness campaign. Credit rating downgraded straight off the bat. No wonder crime is skyrocketing. Holy crap. Well, uncompetitive economy though, and corporate well, corporate exodus is not doing anything, but uncompetitive economy is going down. Black market is we got really high income tax. Border controls are increasing this though. This will lower the black market quite high. Liberals would. We pissed immigration, ethnic minorities, tourism, immigration, patriots would like it, liberals would hate it. How are li liberals kind of like me? Yeah, it costs a lot. Alcohol consumption needs to go. You know what? Let's go with low strength beverages only. We really need to do something with that. It's going to. We got legalized prostitution, huh? Increases GDP. It's interesting. I wouldn't have guessed that, but I guess, you know, what the hell do I know? Alcohol awareness campaign. Where are you? Welfare? Yes. And maybe even alcohol tax. And let's get it to 50%. We really need that one to go. It's gonna help with the budget a bit as well. Damn, expenditures. Holy crap. Uh, rail subsidies. Let's go with... Oh, I can't. Okay, never mind. We need to do something for the poor, though. Do we have food stamps? That's a universally good one. So let's max it out. Uh, gonna negate the effects of increased alcohol tax, hopefully. Um, maybe not. <laughs> we will see. Okay, uh, drug addiction and street gangs. Great. Health is going down, GDP is going down. Crime is fucking insane. Okay, um, what do we do? What do we do? Deficit is just... Community policing to the maximum. Police force to the maximum. What could lower crime as well? ID? No, that's violent. Violent crime is not that bad, though. Crime is. Street gangs, poverty, unemployment, community policing. Hmm. Do we have the CCTV cameras? Those help a lot against crime. We don't, but we could. So next turn. Adult education subsidies I'm all in favor of. And let's get... National Business Council. And... Business Startup Campaign. Okay, you started to get lower. No, why? 
Oh, freaking Christ. Uh, open walls. Yeah, open walls. Oh. Are you actually kidding me? Alcohol tax. What are you? Alcohol law. How long does it take to implement four turns? Hmm. Anti-social behavior is going down though. Stream gangs are going down. Uh, can we... Yeah, we're gonna get the CCTV cameras. Vigilante mobs. Superhero. Budget deficit. It's just awesome in here. Public... Wait, no, it's law and order. CCTV cameras, yeah. They're gonna kill everything, including the liberals. <laughs> what the hell can I do, man? Uh, rail subsidies. Can lower those. And yeah, black market not going away. Obesity not going away. Ah huh, man, this is this is not okay. Corporate exodus is actually going down. Uh, you aren't. Health is an issue. Drug addiction, alcohol abuse, obesity. If they gave you anti mobs, great. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, debt protection law. We're gonna limit agencies' activity. GDP finally going up. Health, crime going down. Oh Jesus, look at that. That's just the CCTV cameras kicking in. Think. I'm sure they're armed. When they have street gangs, vigilante mobs are gone. You are going away. You are going away. You are not. Obesity. Food price. We're gonna get. Jesus. Deficit. Stay now, service. Military spending, child benefits, road building. I'm gonna lower this. And we're gonna get. Mm -mm -mm, public services, free school meals. This one is really good. Poor house, socialist, poverty. Yeah, obesity, education. Good. So let's see. Vigilante mobs gone, anti-social behavior gone, emigration gone, credit rating upgraded, yes, GDP. Okay, that didn't help at all though. Relative GDP is going up, global economy is going down though. Okay, alcohol consumption is almost gone, street gangs are almost gone, that's 10 million right there. Obesity is slowly lowering, uncompetitive economy going down. Corporate exile is gone. Awesome. That's gonna boost the GDP like hell. Economy. Small business grants. Oh, rural development grants. These are great. These are basically everything. And it's also all I can do today. Street gangs gone. Alcohol abuse gone. Organ organized crime developed. How come? Okay, but GDP, yes, GDP is going up. Government borrowing. We really need to do something, guys. This is it. This is just crazy, Bill. Uh, increases crime. Crime, though, is on an all time low. What could. Black market is helping it. And this one costs us a lot. Income tax, sales tax, tobacco tax. Would uh, the fraud agency help? Fraud agency, where is it? Welfare. Economy. Hmm. Monics research grant. There is a... 
Fraud agency. Weapon against organized crime. Yeah, that one helps. It also kills the GDP though. Okay, crime, organized crime. Let's have it like this, 1.2 billion. That should help. And that should help on welfare. We need to, or public services, something. Technology colleges. Yeah, th these help quite a lot. Let's go, let's go maximum. This is really insane, but that's going to help like hell. And the recommending initiative. Cool. Let's see what this one does. Egalitarian society. That's good. War on drugs. Much of the illegal drugs consumed in our nation comes from Tatarstan. Their government, which has a dubious human rights record, has requested military support to attack the drug cartels. Sentry. You know, I know it doesn't help, but we're the justice uh, society, so let's send troops. Okay, deficit is going down. Oh no, you have increased. Or organized crime though. Fraud agency should help with it. Now, what could I do to help? as well. Witness protection program. Violent crime and organized crime. It's gonna help again a lot and I could institute some sort of health food subsidies. How is obesity killing us? What is health? Increase state health service. Do we have free school meals? Yeah we do. A healthy eating campaign in a foreign language class. What about tax? Health food subsidies. Let's get health food subsidies. They lower obesity and tooth decay quite a lot. And let's get actually punitive tax on superstore is gonna hurt GDP. Let's get this one. Increases health. So obesity is slightly increases poverty but I'm okay with that and let's get trade council and anything else that we could do for investor tax small business grants are great but eco home regulations young entrepreneur scheme Income tax, holy fucking Christ. Uh, okay, organized crime, police, witness, fraud agency, GDP. Street gangs are gone, are they? Yeah, why are they still listed? Junk food tax, health food subsidies. I could maybe go with dental program. Or healthy eating campaign. Sure, let's go with it. Gonna increase health. 